Uh, on the China, so the, the administration today rolled out some sanctions against high-level Chinese officials over the Uyghur abuses. But can you speak overall what that does to the U.S. relationship with, with China, and does it jeopardize the phase one deal? Look, I think um, with regard to, I, I look at these Magnitsky Act sanctions and the administration does, um, not with regard to phase one China deal. These are very serious sanctions uh, that were put in place um, by this administration to take strong action against the um, human rights abuses of the Chinese Communist Party. Um, I, I just want to emphasize and underscore that we sanctioned officials, um, several of them, the party secretary, um, his former deputy, and its current party secretary. It's also its former um, its former party secretary. Uh, so that was three. Um, and today's announcement is the latest in a series of actions by the Trump administration. So it's not just the sanctions that were put in place. There were export controls. Controls. The president signed the Uyghur Human Rights Policy Act. So we've taken a very strong stance on the side of human rights and against the atrocities we've seen. And just so the American public knows, um, some of these atrocities have been um, forced abortions and sterilizations and really despicable things that have been done. So the message you're communicating to the Chinese is that this issue is is separate from the phase one trade agreement. It's a, a human rights is, is a paramount issue. It's very important. Uh, we took action. We've crafted a phase one deal. Um, we hope the Chinese government will honor that.